Good afternoon, everyone. Happy new release day. Coming at you with the second half of that master case we popped open. 2018, brand new. Topps Triple Threads Baseball is here. Nine box. Pick your team number two from jazbeescasebreaks.com. Big thanks to all of these folks for getting to the action. A lot of train whistles in the first half. A lot of nice stuff. EA getting the Yankees in a spot random. Paul Hutchins, last spot mojo, A's. So thanks to those two. Thanks to everybody for getting in. Appreciate it. Let me grab the other nine box inner. All right. So there it is. Remember, I marked it number two for break two. Good luck, everyone. Three, three, and three to make nine. All right. Good luck, boys and girls. All right. So what's uh, what's everyone looking for here? Thomas, who has the Rangers, wanted a uh, wanted a Ranger in every box, in every pack. I'm not sure if I can guarantee that, but I hope we do find some Rangers. We didn't see any Rangers in the first half, right? Break one. Gavin is looking for um, looking for some Reese Hoskins for the Phillies. TJ looking for Hunter Renfro. A one of one for Kaoki. Who does he have? Oh, Reds. Jose wants a Miguel Cabrera one of one. Oh, some Johnny Bench. All right, for the Reds. All right, all right. Joel's looking for some Bo Jackson. Eric Coyle is looking for love. This might be the wrong place for that if you're looking for love. In all the wrong places. Josh Pruce. Okay, I see what you're doing, Josh Pruce. He says, I don't want any hits. A little reverse psychology, I see. Charlie Blackman out of 299 for the Rockies. Paul Coolwit with that. We'll top load all those before they go out. Daniel Murphy to 199. Nationals. Conforto. Freddie Freeman. And behind Eric Hosmer is. And Adam Wainwright, 33 out of 36. Helping himself. Helping himself. Uh-oh. Why has it got to be against the Dodgers? Why do they, why, why, why do they do that? All right, that goes to the Redbirds, of course. That'll be for uh, Frank. Frank with that one. Eric Hosmer. Reveals another Cardinal, Tommy Pham, Jersey and Auto this time, 66 out of 99. There's Barry Larkin for the Reds out of 199. There's Goldschmidt for Arthur out of 259. Let's play two in Carlos Correa. Tanaka reveals a Jose Altuve jersey and autograph. One out of 18. Nice Tuve for Eric Coyle and the Houston Astros. So there's some love right there, Eric Coyle. Looking for love in all the wrong places. Masahiro Tanaka reveals another Astro. More love. Carlos Correa. Nine out of 18. It's a day after my birthday. So another Astro for Coil. Next box. Oh, nice. Sean's saying he's going to come back to California in March. You should stop by the shop. We might be in a bigger store by then. Still in the same neck of the woods, though. Eric Coyle saying, Joe, you've been pulling me straight fire lately. Just remember that when you go through a week of, of nothing. of nothing. Be like, remember that one week? We had a good week that one week. 
All right, there's Giancarlo Stan out of 259. Out of 299, Francisco Lindor. Are we going to do a randomizer for the Angels? Maybe. If they don't sell out by the time I finish this break, maybe. How often are books pulled in triple threads? Not super often. Cody Bellinger. Wow. All-star triple relic Cody Bellinger. Five out of nine. Nice one for the Dodgers. Nick Leslie, a little Dodger Joe Mojo. I don't think we saw any Dodgers in the first half or anything significant in the first half, but this is nice. The relics, the little small print says, the relics contained in this card are from a jersey worn during the 2017 MLB All-Star Game festivities. Very cool. All right. Edwin Encarnacion reveals a twin, Jose Barrios. Nice. 11 out of 75. Jersey and auto for the twins. Oh, I see, Brent. I will. Well, I, I don't I don't check the mail, but I'm sure it'll end up on my desk at some point. Thank you. Well, the picture seems to suggest home run derby, right, Gavin? All right, I got to take pictures of those a little bit later. All right. Out of 199, Noah Syndergaard. Out of 259, Steven Strasburg. I don't know. It could have been like a – yeah, what event was he at? Could have been at a, a signing event. Could have been at a, a fan event. Wow. Arthur, look at this. Luis Gonzalez, Paul Goldschmidt, and Jake Lamb, triple relic, triple auto. 15 out of 36, bottom right-hand corner. Arthur, Peru, AP, and the Snakes. He got a one of one Goldschmidt in the previous break. Look at that. All game use memorabilia as well. That's nice. Behind Nolan Arenado is Michael Fulmer. 26 out of 36. Got that single relic going to Jose with the Tigers. Jose on the board. All right, next box. Good luck, ladies and gentlemen. Love this triple threads. So we got more in the store. Check it out, jazbeescasebreaks.com. Uh, what we have, the, the those pick your teams that are on the site, one, two, three, four, are the only ones we have at the moment. But we are getting more. Tomorrow, I think we're getting more. It's what a little little Jaspi bird told me. And, um, and definitely more on Friday. So keep an eye on the website over the next couple days for more triple threads baseball. jazbeescasebreaks.com All right, Evan Longoria out of 259. Still looks kind of weird in a Giants uniform. Going to the Giants. There's Nolan Ryan to 299. Rangers. There's Ben Intendi and Paul Goldschmidt base cards. There's Longoria again revealing a Ronald Acuna Jr. Triple relic and autograph. Three out of 50. Is that your NL Rookie of the Year? Quite possibly. Jared Rupp with the Bravos. Nice. And behind Longo is Joanna Cespedes. 15 out of 27 relic. Mets, Armando. And the Mets. Randy Johnson for the M's out of 259. Javier Baez to 299.
Joey saying definitely rookie of the year for Acuna and AL Otani. I think that's definitely possible. We got Javier Baez, triple relic, 30 out of 36. Multi multi mastery. There you go. Ooh, the first fielding Bible award for him. That goes to Paul Coolwit and the Cubs. And behind Trey Turner is another Cub, Kyle Schwarber, Jersey and Auto, 11 out of 50. Nice Kyle Schwarber for Paul. That's a good question, Rex. I wonder what... Uh, what what the uh, rookie of the year percentage is with going on to become like big stars? It's a very good question. I think there have been a lot of rookies of the year who have not gone on to have very illustrious careers. <laughs> I remember uh, back in the day, um, the Dodgers had a great run of rookies of the years. They had bad teams, but they have good runs of rookies of the years in the 90s, I think. I think Todd Hollinsworth was a guy that never really panned out to be I'm sure I'm sure every I'm sure everyone can can think of a a big rookie, not even a rookie of the year, but a big rookie who maybe finished in the top 5 of rookie of the year voting that never ever really panned out. There's Smoltzy. Out of 299. We got Bregman to 50. Gary Sanchez. Giancarlo Stanton. And behind Xander Bogarts is the triple relic for the Nats. Max Scherzer, Bryce Harper, and Steven Strasburg. What about the last Dodgers rookie of the year, Bellinger? I don't know. I mean, he's only finished his second season. So his body of work is pretty small, but so far so good, I think. I think the upside is definitely there for future stardom, or at least future solid player. Behind Bogarts is Adam Duvall, Jersey and Auto for the Reds, 67 out of 99 for Kaoki and the Red Legs. Joey's asking, should a player that plays multiple positions like Javi not be taken seriously for Gold Glove Awards? I think aren't Gold Glove Awards kind of like the most BSE award out there? A lot of a lot of baseball guys seem to say that that they are all that's so much more reputation based as opposed to actual an actual fielding metric. Out of one ninety nine, Roberto Clemente for the Buccos, for the Bo Sox, two fifty nine, David Ortiz, Beltre, Greg Maddox. And behind Mariano Rivera is Jesse Winker. Triple Relic, an autograph. 36 out of 50. One of the few sticker autos we've seen on the Triple Relics. Um, that's an up-and-coming prospect for the Reds. Kaoki with that one. And behind Mariano Rivera is Mookie Betts for the Red Sox. Is this your... Is this your AL MVP? All right, next box. We got more of this triple threads, brand new release in the store right now, ladies and gentlemen. Jaspiescasebreaks.com. Get them while supplies last. Joey says Trout is your alien. Isn't if it isn't Mike Trout always like it's like you can't give LeBron the MVP every year, so it has to go to someone else. I think that's how Mike Trout will just kind of get screwed out of another MVP award, even though he should be. Dave Barrow's looking for Soto, Juan Soto for the Nationals. Haven't seen him yet. 
All right, there's Honus Wagner. Out of 259, Rex has got some trivia for us. Dodgers have the most rookies of the year of any team in history at 18. Is that right? Yeah, that's right. That In the 90s, it was Caros, Piazza, Raul Montesi, Hideo Noma, and then Todd Hollinsworth all, all in a row. There's Will Myers to 299 for the Friars. Bartolo Colon, Big Sexy, and Don Mattingly, Donnie Baseball. Behind Chris Bryant is Joey Votto. Eight out of nine. Nice. First frame RBI. Another one for the Reds and Kaoki. Look at that. There you go. Joe, Joey's 33 first inning RBI in 2017 were the most by any player in any inning. Wow. There you go. That's cool. And then behind Chris is... Matt, Matt Carpenter. Oh, piece of his lumber and his autograph. 40 out of 50 for the Cardinals. Nice. And that will be Frank with the Redbirds. Yeah, Joey's reminding us that, yeah, right, Trout only has two MVPs. I think he's finished second in like three other MVP voting years. Kershaw out of 99. Yeah, Trout should have, I mean, it was the Triple Crown by Miguel Cabrera that uh, that ruined his, I was right behind me, that freaked me out. Chris Sale, Chris Davis, Frank Thomas, hey, we're trying to do a break. Guys, keep it down, we're trying to do a break here. I know they have fires to fight. Nelson Cruz reveals a Josh Hader. 34, we're pulling too much heat. They were going to douse douse us with, with, with water. With Jaspies, pulling too much heat. Nice Josh Hader, 34 out of 50. Triple relic and autograph. Where's that relic? What is this from? Those aren't. Those look like Padres colors. Or unless this was was he in a futures game maybe, when the All Star game was in San Diego and they kind of had all the. I don't know where did that come from. Anyway, nice Josh Hader for Jeff Goldenthal and the Brewers. And behind Nelson Cruz is J D Martinez, thirty one out of thirty six. There you go, Bo Sox. That'll be for Ryan Wengreen. All right, next one. But yeah, that year Miguel Cabrera won the Triple Crown. I think he really only won it because he got that symbolic Triple Crown, which people thought was cool. But that's kind of, sometimes that's kind of all it is. It's just a cool feat. But but all of the war numbers suggest, wins above replacement numbers suggest that, that Trout was just better overall, which is kind of crazy. I want to say that, that there have been some triple crown winners in like the 50s or 60s that have not won the MVP award. So it shouldn't really be an automatic, but for whatever reason, I guess we haven't we hadn't seen it in a while. So Mike Trout kind of got screwed out of that MVP. Nice Jackie Robinson out of 199. Xander Bogarts 259. We got Evan Longoria and Let's Play 2 Ernie Banks. And then behind Carlos Correa is Max Scherzer. 5 out of 36. There you go. Wow, really? I haven't seen that very often. The, the the immaculate, the immaculate strikeout. Nice. 
Nine pitches, three strikeouts. That's crazy. That goes to Dave Barros in the Nationals. Carlos Correa with a Michael Conforto jersey and auto. Five out of 99 for Armando and the Mets. Freddie Freeman for the Braves out of 250. Lou Gehrig to 299, Yankees. Will Myers, Charlie Blackman. And your hits behind Francisco Lindor is a Cub. What's the haps? Ian Hap. One out of 18. And that's Paul Cool Whit with the Cubbies. And pick your team two. And behind Francisco Lindor, we've got a Tiger. V Mart, Victor Martinez. 14 out of 18 for Jose and the Tigers. All right, nice. There you go. Three boxes left and pick your team two. Good luck, everyone. How are we doing on pick your team three and four? I'm assuming we're, we're getting closer. All right, well, keep it going. Jaspiescasebreaks.com. Remember, the, those pick your team breaks are the only cases we have at the time. We should be getting more tomorrow, definitely getting more on Friday. All right, next one. Number three is sold out, says Nick. Out of 299, Kyle Schorber. Carlos Correa. Yeah, we may need to run an Angel Spot randomizer. Or no, if three is sold out, that means the Angels are sold out, right? So maybe just the Yankee spot random then? Well, whatever the case is, go check it out, jazbeescasebreaks.com. There's Steven Strasburg, war, 16 out of 27. No, lies from Enmar. Nick's saying, just kidding, there's three left. All right. Well, fill it up, folks. Steven Strasburg. War, what is it good for? It's good for kind of broadly uh, broadly evaluating players, I think. That goes to Dave Barros, Nationals. Felix Hernandez reveals an Oriole. Trey Mancini, 54 out of 99, jersey and autograph for the Orioles. Josh Pruce. I know, right? Not a Yankee in this one. Yet, EA, yet. All right, out of 199, Ryan Sandberg, Paul Cool Whit, Michael Conforto out of 259 for the Mets, Joey Votto, Mookie Betts, and behind Javier Baez is Sean Newcomb, triple relic and autograph, 40 out of 99 for Jared Rupp and the Braves. So Stephen K saying we still have Angels, Marlins, and Phillies left in break three. Go and get it, ladies and gentlemen. And behind Javier Baez is Christian Yelich for the Brewers. 18 out of 36. Nice one for the Brew Crew. It's another one for Jeff Goldenthal. All Two boxes left.
All right, there's Kershaw out of 259. Got signed his extension, which I think was a fair deal. Trey Turner out of 299. Dave Barros, Nationals. Jackie Robinson, Josh Donaldson, and Justin Upton will reveal a Yankee. There it is, EA. One out of nine. Andy Pettit. Vintage stuff. Triple relic and autograph. See? Got to play the whistle. Nice low numbered Andy Pettit. And behind Justin Upton is. Mark McGuire, 9 out of 9. Cardinals edition of Mark McGuire. Piece of his lumber goes to uh, Frank and the Redbirds. And EA got the uh, got the Yankees in a spot random, ladies and gentlemen. Got the Yankees for, for a lesser price, a fraction of the price. Out of 259, Ty Cobb. No books yet, Jeremy. Ty Cobb. Daniel Murphy to 299. Ryan Braun, Hank Aaron. And behind Andrew McCutcheon is Addison Russell, 25 out of 27 for Paul Coolwit and the Cubs. Nice triple relic there. Two extra base hits in one inning. Wow. Must have been a big inning for the Cubs. There's Kutch and Michael Fulmer, jersey and autograph, one out of 50. It's an autograph for the Tigers. Uh, Tigers, yeah. Jose with the Tigres. All right. And the last box, ladies and gentlemen. Good luck. This is Pick Your Team 2. Pick Your Team 3, not sold out yet. So let's get that done. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com. That comes from a fresh master case. And we won't have any more Pick Your Teams. Uh, won't have any more Pick Your Teams after this for today anyway. But we should have more tomorrow or Friday. Well, EA, next time you should just buy them straight up. Ooh, and a redemption. Any guesses on that redemption? Miguel Cabrera, 259. Corey Kluber to 299. Roger Clemens, Robinson Cano. And behind Trey Turner is a 1 out of 9, Francisco Lindor. Nice. That'll be for uh, Paul Nixon. There you go, Paul. Paul with the Tribe. And Trey Turner reveals Mariners edition of A-Rod, 17 out of 36. And that A-Rod will go to Patrick K and the Mariners. Joey Votto to 299. Cody Bellinger to 99. Tanaka, Babe Ruth. I've heard of that guy. Mike Trout reveals... A Masahiro Tanaka, 7 out of 27. Zeros in Boston, triple relic for EA and the Yankees. All right, so what, what guesses do we have? Didi, Gregorius, Chris Bryant, Rizzo, Juan Soto, another Lewis Brinson. John Oakley also guessing Lewis Brinson. Triple auto relic Yankees guessing Jeremy. David No also saying... Bryant, maybe Glaber Torres. It's not, I'm trying not to look at it. All right. Mike Trout, 
Show me. Show me rookie autograph card gold. S. H. O. H. E. I. Tani. Shohei Otani. Showtime for Chad Ogden and the Angels. Nice. That is a great way to end the break, ladies and gentlemen. Nice show, hey, Otani, to close things out for the Los Angeles Angels of Anaheim, California, and Orange County. Triple threads, pick your team two in the books. We've got a fresh master case available in the store right now, jazbeescasebreaks.com. Check it out, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.